good morning friends uh, today in this video we will see uh, how to change the standard objects uh, using extensions in visual studio code so i have already opened up the visual studio code so let me start up with the new project here press ctrl shift p and click on al go and it is suggesting me the project name i will change this change standard object select your platform and now select your own server it has opened up the json file here so based on my service instance i'll change the authentication to windows and provided the port also as 8049 okay so now before i start uh, making any table extension on page extension i will click again as ctrl shift p and download symbols symbols have been downloaded successfully so that's great now i'll click here the default file which is created by the system uh, so first of all i'll change the name of this file click on f2 and change the name of the file as general ledger setup table .al. so this means that we will, we are going to create a new field in the standard uh, table object of general ledger setup okay so to create a layout uh, by default we have to type here as t table and select t table extension and see by default it uh, generated me it generated a default layout of the table extension so here i will provide the extension uh, id as 50110 and provide the name as general ledger setup extend and here i have to provide the standard table object as general ledger setup okay now in the field section we have to uh, because i have to create a new field so i have to add the field syntax here so this is the fields group where we can add multiple fields so because I have to add only one field, I'll add one field here as uh, now again I will use the uh, default uh, syntax called starting with as tf and just select it and it by default uh, generate a layout, a default layout of the field. Here I will uh, provide the id as 50,000. and provide the name of the field uh, test my field test new field or i should write any general name as master permission so here i have to provide it under quotes sorry I have to provide under double quotes because I am giving a space in between the names and here I will write as boolean ok now I have provided the field to this field section and that is that's it with my table part just delete the default code so now this code suggests that we are going to create a new field called as master permission in the standard table of general ledger setup uh, now because we are extending it and we are not making a change in the standard table so that's why we extend all the functions fields of this table under this new table called as general ledger setup extension okay now because we are done with the table extension 
we would like to view this field also in the page part so we will create a page extension of the general ledger setup but before that uh, i would like to write one code also on the value on the on the validate trigger of this new field so to do that i will write here as trigger on validate and here i will write as begin if allow posting from is let's say less than today then print a message welcome to al world okay and just write here as n okay so we are done with the table part so let's add new file in this same project and create a new page extension for the general ledger setup page i'll click on this icon new file and provide a name as general setup page dot al okay so now here again i will use a uh, shortcut to create a layout for the page extension page and to do that i'll write as t page and here it is suggesting me the options and i will select this option as t page extension and it again uh, generated a default layout for the page extension type again i will provide here the id as 5101 and type the name of this page as general ledger set up page extension and extend it the standard page of the general ledger setup as tiger general ledger setup okay so now in the layout part because i would like to add this field in the general tab of the general ledger setup page so what I will do here is I will use a function called add add last in the general tab and here I will use the page field okay so here we have to provide the name of this new field which we have created in the table as master permission okay and in case you would like to provide any caption for it you can provide the same or caption as master permission So guys it is showing me some error I think okay I'll just put semicolon here and that's it so now in this page in this code we have created a new page extension where we are extending the general ledger setup page of standard page and here we have introduced our new field which we have created in the table extension as master permission and adding that field in the general tab okay so now when we are done with the new table and new page so the rest part is that we have to deploy this project into an extension form in the business central way to and see whether our new field is available or not so we all know to deploy or to publish to deploy to deploy or publish this code or this project into an extension in the business central we have to press f5 so i'll press f5 here and it is doing all the setups required for it and see it is by default opening the new 
uh, instance of the business center and first of all let's check whether our extension has been deployed successfully or not so i'll type here is extension and click here and if i see uh, our see our extension as chain standard objects project which we created in the visual studio code is now available here so that's it so let me click here and let's see the general ledger setup page this is here i'll click it and see this is the general tab and whether our new field is available here or not and see our new field as master permission is showing here and because uh, let's test another thing we have written the code in on the validate of this field as whenever we do the validation system will check if the today's if the allow posting from is less than the today it will print a message and we can see here that allow posting from is blank so if i do it as true so see it is showing me a message called welcome to al world so this suggests that uh, although uh, we are doing or working in the general ledger setup page which is a standard page but uh, we have we have done all this change using uh, an extension where we did not change any standard object but uh, extending the properties of the st standard page into a, our new customized page uh, so guys uh, if you really like this video please share this video please click the like button and please uh, hit the subscribe button also uh, thank you very much for watching this video